After roaming the expanses of Kruger, three brothers moved into the Timbavati and found an unattended piece of land south of Shabili territory. They have not crossed the invisible line into the old lion's turf. Not yet. The brothers are four years old. They are strong and confident. Every week, they kill a buffalo. Their constant success in hunting attracts the attention of the three lionesses that left the old Shabili male. The bravest one tests the brothers. It's a very bold move. It's the brother's kill, and as an outsider, she has no right to it. Submission is key. Getting in with these strong brothers will bring a prosperous time. Boldly, she moves in. Right under one of the brothers' nose. By morning, two of the sisters are still feeding. And there is a third lion with them, a young male, the oldest sister's son. His presence at the kill could jeopardize his mother and aunt's future relation with the coalition of males. By being here, he is taking a dangerous chance. The brothers return. The young male moves away before they can attack him. The brothers claim their kill. The sisters' time at the carcass is over. They now settle for some scattered bones, which they take a safe distance away from the brothers. One of the males keeps an eye on them. The young male hasn't moved far, but long term, if he stays, he will be killed because he is a male intruder on the brother's land. He is a threat to their authority. They must chase him away. The brother stops the chase. This time, he is lucky to get away with just a bloody scratch. The young male knows his time here is coming to an end. Out there, every hectare is owned by lions more powerful than he. Their territories are clearly defined, forming a...